I would probably say like up until a few years ago, you know, we would both be so exhausted. You know what I'm saying? Like feeling like a wet noodle or whatever. And um, we couldn't, we didn't, we didn't realize or didn't know what was going on. And then, you know, we're always studying and researching. And then we finally ran across one of the videos that um, one of the one of the one of the video um, or the content creators that we follow and I'm like yes that's what's going on with us you know we're pulling energy off of people you know bad energy you know whatever it is that they're you know going through or dealing with you know we're pulling that off of them so um that's absolutely a fact. And we have to learn that the hard way. How important do you think it is to be careful in choosing who does your self-care in talking about the energy? You so know, you're it speaking sounds like from, you can't just go to anyone. You should be, well, you know, selective. So you're speaking in terms of people coming to the Scratcher Girls or the Scratcher Girls going to someone else or just in general all together speaking to the fact that you both have great energy and Period, you can't just go to anyone to get your self-care because the type of energy that you're choosing is so important i'm glad you asked mm -hmm. that which makes you the perfect girl to vibe with tonight <laughs> but let me tell you i believe that to be absolutely true okay. um you guys have always told us that <clears throat> You know, that you like our energy, that you love our energy, and, and, and that you crave our energy, you know? Um, it's funny that you said that because so many people are like, no, you know, I'm going to start one. Um, you know, in fact, you know, someone just said that they, you know, would like to start one. And we absolutely, you know, encourage it. But, you know, people think, oh, it's just a matter of, oh, you just say, I'm going to open up a back-scratching business, and that's it. And that's really not it. You know, there's so much that you have to consider, that you would have to know, that you would have to keep in mind. And one of those things is, you know, what we do is just, it's more than a back scratch, uh -huh. you know? I would say that there's intention. I was gonna say we intentionally, mm -hmm. you know, set our energy because we understand and know that we are, you know, working, you know, on people. And it's, and it's, it's crucial, you know, it's serious. It, the transference of energy is no joke, you know? And so we always, like Scratch Your Girl Passion mentioned tonight, you know, with me, you know, helping with the scratch. You know, sometimes you have to know yourself as well, right? Mm -hmm. um, when we know we have clients, you know, that are coming in, you know, we have to really ground ourselves and get ourselves yeah. mentally, you know, prepared, you know. And oftentimes you have to know when your energy is not, you know, good you know, in, in, in order to work on someone else because then you're going to transfer that bad energy that they're trying to get off of them. You're going to transfer more, you know, bad or negative energy onto them. So, you know, you have to really be careful about that. And I think self-awareness is absolutely key. You have to be aware of what, you know, what's going on around you, what's going on inside of you. You have to be aware of that, you know. Um, and, and people can tell. How about that? You know, people can tell. And I would say that's why I've always returned here. Yeah. Because, you know, we've built a relationship, but even more than that, I feel safe here. And, I and feel, you've always said that. And I feel relaxed here. Yeah, you've always said that. So, and we can tell. Me being skeptical or what have you, that's neither here nor there. I'm willing to try it. Well, no, no, I no. Trust, I trust. I don't you think know. you were skeptical about, you know, us doing no. that for you. Right, because you know us and you know our energy. But I think, you know, like, we've had some guys to come in, they're diehard, you know, massage guys. Mm -hmm. they, they want their massage, they like the firmness and whatever. But let me tell you, when they got up off of the table, they're like, oh my gosh, mm -hmm. you know, I really like this. I think my favorite part were the legs, you know, that type of stuff. So, you know, it's not, you know, it, it doesn't surprise us. I think we actually like the challenge, you know, because this is one of those things that's, you know, refutably, like, amazing. It feels amazing. But, you know, everyone doesn't, I, I'll tell you, I, I, I'm always talking about the business everywhere I go. And when we were in, in Cleveland, you know, um, I mentioned it to uh, one of the people at the place where, you know, we rented the car from. 
And, you know, she checked out the website. And, you know, I asked her if she had a chance to check it out, you know, when I returned the car. And she says, oh, you know, it, was just, it looks pretty cool, but I just don't think that's for me. And it's not for everyone. Everything isn't for everyone. And we understand that. But I will say that all of the thousands of people that we've serviced, you know, um, they loved it. But we understand that everything isn't for everybody. And we don't take it personal, you know. Not at all. Temperature, alive, we are just getting started, so I just temperature good, to Kate? let a few more people get in here. Um, we're just gonna be scratching just upper body today, arms, head, you know, side of our face, life. ears, hair, um, and then we're going to get a live review on how she feels after her session. So. Um, she was actually concerned about the way she was dressed today, but again, as we say, it really doesn't matter. It's to your comfort level of how you, um, you know, um, dress when you come in. But I mean, the more skin, the better, right? Mm -hmm. You can hit my legs too. Oh yeah, we're, we're gonna hit those legs. You might calves. really appreciate that mm -hmm. through the, let me tell you, she might actually appreciate her legs through the sheet. Um, as you can see, it's kind of a thin sheet here, you know? guys can see from over there I don't know maybe on this side so then she it's not too thick you know um so she can still feel it through her um through the sheet on her legs so maybe we will tap a little legs um it won't be much visual but it'll be visual um I at least want to see at least 100 people in here share the video guys um gifts are greatly appreciated of course we're trying to become your number one and top creators here on tiktok um, so far, so good. The feedback has been amazing. We do question and, I mean, yeah, uh, Q&A, of course. We do Q&A as well. Um, how do you feel? The temperature in the room? It's okay Everything for you? feels perfect. You ready for your towel? 96. I said I was going to wait till we get 100. Come on, guys. Keep liking, sharing the video. Again, I want to become your top creator so that we can do this for you every night before bed. Okay, you have to want me to be here. So to confirm that for me, I'm gonna need to make sure that I have everybody liking, subscribing, sharing, and those gifts are highly appreciated, guys. All right, we're, why are we at 99? Share it with one more person. Share it with one more person, guys. And then I'll go get the hot towel and we'll prepare to get ready. I'll flip it like I do with other clients. I'll just flip it up here, up, up, up on your backside, and then I'll do the legs. So um, we're gonna actually go ahead and do the legs without the sheet, guys. So that's gonna be pretty exciting. Skin, skin. So yeah. Oh my God. Why are we at 99? We need one more person. Share it with one more person, guys. Because we got 99 problems. We got 99. No, we don't got problems. Got problems. No, 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 no. We don't want to say it's but a problem. But stress isn't going to be But one. stress is not. Ooh, we got nine and five, but stress is not one. They, oh, we have 101. Thank you guys for sharing. So we're going to get started. I'm going to get the hot towel, which is probably ready for me right now. I'm going to shut my big mouth. I'm going to let you guys enjoy. Mom's going to be her. Be, Mom's going to be using her beautiful whisper voice for you guys to answer any questions that you guys may have. Um, yeah, let's get started.
it's just a process to, you know, help you relax. Of course, something like this is always soothing. Don't help me in any way. If I move to a limb, you know, like if I'm on your arms, please don't help me. Let me move it myself, okay? You just, your job is just to relax. If there's anyone who would know that, it's you. Yes. <laughs> don't help me, please. All right? That's all I'm going to say. And yes, it's because I know her, so please relax. Let me do for you. You're so used to doing for everybody else. Let me do, let me do for you, honey. Okay, let me do for you. That's what, in my Michelle voice, that was my, you know, good friend. A while ago. So guys, I ask again, we want to give this to you every day, right? But of course, it has to make sense for us. Um, I always tell people we're business owners first, content creators second. So you have to make it worth us being here to give you guys this live every day. We offer free sessions for people that are dear to us just so that we can create content for you guys. So in order for us to be here, you have to show us you want us to be here. Let us know what you want to see, okay? Communicate, talk. Huh? My other phone? Oh, awesome. I just got the number going good. Gift or badge. Yeah, let me give the phone to mom so she can keep track of that because what is it now? I'm not paying attention to any gifts or anything. Sorry about that, guys. I'm I'm in scratcher girl mode, so you Chrissy, have to bear with me. Gift their bag. Thank you what so much, mean? Chrissy. Did I say your name right, Chrissy? Mm -hmm. Thank you. We appreciate you. Chrissy, I don't know what any of that means. Please forgive me. I guess they'll school me on it later. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. So, this is um, our special eucalyptus lotion. I love the smell of this lotion. All of our clients almost die and go to heaven after this. And this is just... Huh? So, I think we're about nailing it, guys. Are we ready? I'm ready. <laughs> Leslie, can she get a pillow? You're so sweet, sugar. She has a pillow, though. You want a bigger pillow? You sure? Mm -hmm. You heard it from her mouth, guys. She She's said great. this was crazy. She's probably experiencing tingles all over her body. See, guys, what you don't understand is it's the techniques for sure. 
It's the techniques, it's the pressure, it's the care, it's the attention. The energy. The energy. All of this is wrapped yeah. in one, guys. So. I'm just going to allow Kate to relax. She came so far and had a, from a flight this morning, so. From the Bahamas, so we're going to allow her to enjoy. She would like to talk about a little bit on how she's feeling, guys. And let us know if you can't hear her, because she does have a very soft voice. Tell her all the time. I have a very relaxed voice. But at first, it's not ticklish, but it feels different. And then as passion moves her hands, very elegantly actually <laughs> over your body it's almost like your skin is waking up wow it feels you know you can kind of feel the energy moving over your body your skin is waking up and it's almost like your senses are kind of waking up as well it's, it's different usually at this point in a massage they're just trying to warm up your muscles so it's a little more intense. And this is absolutely relaxing. Yay. And you heard it from the horse's mouth. We knew that we would pick the right <clears throat> person to go live with. Yeah, we really did. Because she's very vocal, very descriptive. Yes. Yeah. Like, she's very, very descriptive. Yeah. So if you guys, even if you're not here on the table, after she describes to you all what yeah. she's feeling you're gonna feel like you're here too In the session, I would highly recommend for the ladies yeah. to not wear anything on top or to have like a bikini top on that you can like unclip or something if you want to yeah, be a little more this, modest. Yeah, you want the full, mm -hmm. you want to feel it. It's very true. 
I am like craving just to be yeah, a little more this, modest. Yeah, you want the full, mm -hmm. you want to feel it. It's very true. I am like craving just. Okay. My apologies. I don't know, but I hope they don't call again. Did you turn your ring girl? No. first time that you provided this service for someone? Oh God. Well, mm -hmm. the, first time, mm -hmm. <laughs> the first time I provided this service like this for someone was probably when I was seven. You know, um, it was my mom. I was the first, well, one of the first honorary scratcher girls. You know, after a while she had to pay, we did it for free for a very long time. Then I started to realize my worth. And I was worth more than doing it for free because I understood how she was feeling. Every night, this was her request. So it was my mom. After that, I'm going to tell you who were our regulars. There were these two ladies from Jersey whose husbands worked in construction down here. No, they were not from Jersey. They were from the Hamptons. Hamptons, excuse me. Yeah, they were from the Hamptons. Yeah. But they were the ones that we did on a regular. They came down like once, maybe twice a month sometimes with their husbands in their hotels and or their condo. And that were that was the first late. That was the first like real regular price that we have with this. It's beautiful, yeah. They wanted nothing but the sound of the ocean. You know, and the scratches. They wanted no music or anything. Breathing is also very important with your service, guys. It helps with the relaxation process. So far, back is awesome, but definitely the arms, arms I know. heels. Yeah, everybody's favorite is the arms. This is like, I think this is the part that allows them to relax. So for me, that's why I always start with the back. I don't want to tell my secrets, though. I don't want to tell the secrets, but I'm going to tell secrets. But 
but I always start with the back. The back is typical. Your back is always touched, right? From when somebody's petting, you know, uh -huh. a hug, when they're patting on the shoulder, say, oh yeah, you know, any type of touch on the, that is done to like, in human interaction is done on the back, for the most part, hands too. But when you talk about somebody actually like touching your arms, or just caressing your arms or anything like that. These are parts of your body that are rarely ever touched by anyone. So I always start with the back because it's the typical part, you know? Of course, in the back, you're just getting into it. But the arms, the arms is another level. That's like getting like, oh, we're getting somewhere. But when I get to that neck and that face, that's when I know I got you. So I always start, you know, the legs are euphoric too. I can't wait to show you the legs. Probably talking too much. Let me see. Let's see what people are talking about. <laughs> Somebody said neck and face. Yep, that's kind of nice. Somebody said side of the neck. Just be patient. Just be patient. Let her enjoy every part. But I feel like my favorite part on my head or my be like right behind what like you know your ear your ear into your scalp the ears a thing i can't wait to show you the whole thing i can't wait this is just the tip of the iceberg that is crazy yeah tip of the iceberg girl let me just make sure i'm letting everybody see what we're doing here a little bit God, I'm not good at this, guys. Bear with me here. Just because you're tiny. I know. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> Literally. So if you didn't know, <laughs> passion is the most petite little thing. Oh, my gosh. And I am like 5'10". Yeah. <laughs> She's Amazon, guys. She's a model. Model material. Mm -hmm. Totally at Amazon. I love her height. So, I'm just going to do a little bit. That is wild. You still not relaxed. Oh, you're trying my face. She's not relaxed, guys. I'm yelling at her right now. You're used to that, though. I know. <laughs> but I thought this would help, you know. It I is helping. Get her to, yeah. I think... For sure, the first time, it's such a new sensation that I think, you know, the body is still kind of like, whoa. Yeah, I know. What is this? Yeah. Because mm -hmm. we're, not, we, we're not used to being cared whoa. for like this. It's crazy, I'm telling you. It's, so it's almost like the body is like curious of like learning how to receive this. Uh-huh. Yeah. Right? Gosh, you're so What's like the most common reaction that you have from your clients during this? <laughs> I'm gonna be time? honest. Every time I mostly uh, every client when I get on the head, I hear, oh, yeah, like you know, like wow, like this is crazy, you know. I get that all the time. You know, a lot of people still are in disbelief of the feeling, you know, because we don't get this. We don't get this treatment. You know. How do you deal? Is it common that maybe you have people who are ticklish? You know what? I do. We do get a lot of people that are ticklish in like just certain areas. But what we do is we just read the body language. We try to go firmer first. But then if they're not getting used to it in like a fashionable time, we just leave them off. You know? Yeah. Because we want you to relax. That's what's important, you know? So we don't want you like laughing, you know? I mean, laughter is beautiful, but you know. I feel like, and it's not tickling, but it's almost like I feel tingles yeah. mm -hmm. down my yeah. arm yeah. into my fingertips. Yeah. And it's just really crazy. <laughs> I have so many beautiful words, and I keep yeah. going back to crazy because I think <laughs> everybody says they they can't even they don't even know the they can't find the words no. to describe it. Like that's like Ooh. 
everybody's angle when they go into trying to tell us how they felt during the service. But I think my body is just trying to understand. Oh wow, this, that's another good, this, yeah. This type of touch. Yeah, that's another good way to describe it. But yeah, ladies, no tank top. <laughs> no tank top, yeah. For sure. But I will say, even if you feel you have to ease into it, so far the arms are my favorite. Yeah, we get that a lot. Arms are my favorite. Yeah, we get that a lot. Sorry guys, I'm trying here, I'm trying to multitask and do everything. Bear with me. That was just the alarm to say that I'm warm up. Yeah, ah, see, that was bad. <laughs> Do you have, like out of all the clients you see, mm -hmm. what is like the largest like age group that you service Ooh. or like most common? Do you find that it's usually younger people who come I'm to gonna you? I'm going to tell you, or? probably like 23 to probably like 35, maybe 40s. Really? Yeah, definitely. Um, we get kids, a lot of kids too, who are fans, you know, which is a beautiful thing, dragging their moms in here for a service, you know. They don't even know what to expect, but then we have kids who come alone or you know with their siblings and their mom so that's a beautiful experience but i will say this we had one lady to come in with her mom and her mom was how old was she mom 80 something yeah, she was i remember her 80s. saying it on film but i can't really yeah, remember she but was in her 80s. she her was birthday. so grateful to the service oh my god can you imagine the lack of touch that yeah. she experiences you know so that yeah. brings me to like your next question i'm guessing well our <laughs> like point is because, like, even right now, I do work in the hospitality industry. Mm -hmm. And so in our spas, we're becoming more, you know, educated on servicing persons who either have an illness oh, wow. or, uh -huh. you know, might be going through chemotherapy or mm -hmm. cancer treatment, things like that. Mm -hmm. Because for a long time, those persons couldn't get any form of service. Really? And it's still kind of common today, right? Mm -hmm. Same it thing is. Same thing goes for elderly persons who might be a little weak or they right? can't take the pressure of physical therapy mm -hmm. or massage therapy. Mm -hmm. And so I really would urge persons, especially for your parents or those persons who may not even necessarily like the pressure from massage therapy. Mm -hmm enjoy this yeah right for persons who might have feeble bones or mm -hmm. you know they don't want to risk injury are you guys hearing this right now to so